Hello everyone, my name is Rad Simmer and this is a new series on my channel. It is going to be the Midnight Sun Challenge and I'm going to discuss with you guys what I'm gonna do with this challenge. Right no not right here, but I'll tell you guys, you know, my goal of this challenge in a second. If you the Midnight Sun Challenge is uh fairly popular I I think it's a great idea and I was you know really excited about doing it and I just really wanted to have the right materials and you know be really prepared for it before I started it because you know it's hard it's a hard challenge and I I know that but um I'm really excited to do this so the this is not the world that came with the rules um someone just Okay, this is not the world that came, this is not the world that came with the rules, uh, I'm bending the rules a little bit, I'll explain to you guys in a second, but, what is this, oh, it's her, <laughs> I have no idea, um, but, this is the Midnight Sun Challenge, you are pretty much on an abandoned island, you wake up, and you're on an island, and I'll explain to you guys, our heir, our founder, and I have the register mod in. No one is supposed to spawn. No wildlife, no stray cats, no deer, no tourists, nothing. Um, if the occasional, you know, paparazzi show up, it's all good. I'll just delete them. I don't know how to get rid of the paparazzi sometimes. But this world is, like, kind of weird. If I don't know if you guys see this, but I definitely do. But we'll figure that out soon. So... This is our girl here. Her name is Kirsten Sanders. Or Kirsten. Kirsten. I'm going to call her whatever comes to mind. And Miss Kirsten is, well, she grew up, you know, with lots of money and had everything pretty much handed to her. And, you know, she lives the perfect life. She's beautiful. She has a beautiful family, a beautiful fiancé. And, you know, he, she, like, she was on a cruise ship. And she jumped off the cruise because she hated her life. She was very depressed and suicidal. And she just wanted to be done with her life. And she jumped off, not in the, the, the intentions of getting on an abandoned island. But, you know the attentions that she would die and you know it's kind of a touchy it's kind of a, uh, kind of a touchy, touchy subject but that is her little backstory now her traits are really crappy for the sake that I didn't want to give her like green thumb trait and like all these good ass traits as if she like knew this how to do everything before you know so I gave her her real traits so she is adventurous she's over emotional a party animal a snob and a diva so you know we got our work cut for her she doesn't really have any good skills or good traits that will help her in this challenge but you know we'll get through it so that is kirsten and the whole purpose of the challenge is to get five generations on the islands with like you know it's like a legacy five generations and i am not gonna promise you that i'm gonna do five i'm definitely gonna do one and um that's pretty much it i'm not gonna promise you guys five generations if you if this challenge becomes popular and you guys want to see more then like i will totally do it you know but i'm definitely gonna do one because i want to um the thing is I, why i got this world is because there's three other lot, two other lots. This one right here. I think they're all 64 by 64 lots. And then there's one over here. So we can literally move people out of the household. And when I did the Midnight Sun Challenge all like by myself a year ago or something, maybe not that much. No, maybe not a year ago. But it got crazy because so many people were on the lot and you know it was just nuts and I couldn't do it. There were so many people to control. People were, everyone was flirting with each other. The relationships got ruined. It was just a bad time. 
So that's why. There's room so we can kick people out. They can move on in another lot. You know, they don't have to leave the island, but they can move on to another lot, you know? So, Kristen, she looks like this. I, I'm going to take you guys into create a sim because, you know, why not? You get a good look there. Ah, the way. Hey, girl. And, you know, she's has really light makeup. She's just got lashes on and maybe a little bit of blush. You know, she's got nice hair. She's, like, got an ombre color, but she's eventually going to lose that ombre, you know, because she can't dye it unless she figures out some voodoo to do it. So, she's got, like, this hair that looks like she's been in the ocean for years. <laughs> and, you know, she's really cute, really pretty. I think she is beautifully stunning. And, yes, that is Miss Kirsten Sanders. And we're going to get right into this thing. And buy her the only thing, sh the some things that she can have. And the rules is that you have to buy a lot and you'll be left with about 1,300 simoleons. I, that's not how much this lot costs. I just, like, took out some of the, the money because I'm not going to do that. She had, like, 9,000 simoleons and that's way too much. So... What we have to do here is get a fridge. We have a big lot. You know, it's huge. We're not going to use all of it. I want to kind of not stress it out, stretch it out too much. Oh my god, we're running out of money already. We I don't even know what am I doing? Okay. Hopefully, this refrigerator... Oh, shit. It doesn't have any. But, what we're gonna do... I'm gonna sell this because I don't want that refrigerator. It's annoying. So, we're gonna get a mini fridge. For now. We don't need a stove. We just need a sink. Does this work? It won't work. So, we're just, you know... I got move objects on. Let me turn it off. Move objects off. There we go. And bathroom. We can just put her outdoor shower here with a cheapy toilet that needs a wall. How annoying. I hate that. Okay. I'm just, you know, getting situated here, guys. We have our tent. And we need an eating area. Actually, first we need a wall. <laughs> wall. No? No? Oh, God. We have no money. We're not even able to afford a toilet. Okay. Why are we so low on money? I'm confused. So we could put that there. Our toilet here. Right? Yeah. Slaying it, killing it. Ten simoleons to her name. She's gonna have to eat on the toilet. We can sell this because we can. <laughs> Oops, no no no. We just need to get some walls up here because they're gonna cry. Yeah, killing it, killing it, killing it, killing it. Okay, and she has her camera, but I'm not gonna sell that. Excuse me, I just hiccuped. I'm not gonna sell that yet. So we're gonna place our tent, and we're gonna get ready. Are you ready for this? Uh, her lifetime wish is live in the lap of luxury, which, you know, we can totally do. That's a good one. So... I'm pretty sure this place should have spawners. It looks like they have fish spawners here. Maybe we can find some seeds, start up gardening or something. Because that is, you know, we're living off the land. And look at this. This is so pretty. I love it. I love it. So how about she goes do some exploring. She wants to learn the cooking skill. And she can't take a class. She... Uh, no, no, sweetie, cart. Ah, can't speak. 
and you can't join my career. So I'm just going to scope around this place. It's actually really pretty. Oh, there's a little boat. Abandoned boat. How rad, man. Oh. I have to... No. Delete the mailbox so the mailman doesn't come. Right. Yep. And we don't get bills because we don't get bills. So I don't think anything's gonna spawn for quite a while. So if she can go fishing. Fish. This is beautiful. There's a uh, fountain. This is pretty. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, okay. Come on, I wanna take a picture. Oh, this is pretty. I dig it. Very nice. Fish are biting here. This is probably for, like, really good fish. But let's see what this world has. Just a lot. I thought it had maybe something else. There's a little... That's worth more than 25 grand. Okay, girl. Okay. It's got me the Island Paradise vibe, Isla Paradiso vibe, which like I love. I think it's the best expansion pack like ever. I love hearing the birds chirping and all that stuff. So, oh, did we just get our portal? Where is our portal? Here it is. We we are going to sell the portal because we can. Okay. <laughs> um we now she has to find a quote unquote mate and she, why does she have that do we stuff on her? Oh, it's probably sunscreen. It looks like it's like a little sunscreen, but I didn't mean to do that, but you know. It's a good idea. She's catching some anchovies, but she has to find a quote-unquote mate, and um, that's just to do through the World Adventures expansion. I have the Travelers mod, so we can travel. Oh, I didn't save yet. Okay. So we can totally travel, but it's going to cost at least like $1,300, I think, is the smallest amount. And she can't really have a job. She could be, I don't think, yeah, she can't have a job. She can't be self-employed or anything. Because who's going to pay her, you know? You're a cutie girl. And she's getting up her scale. I'm going to get her up one scale and we'll be good to kidding. go. Two anchovies. And ugh, I kind of want to sell her camera so we can go on vacation and get this game started. So I'm going to do that. Okay. So, I'm going to end this part early, and in the next part, I am going to do some traveling with her, and I will show you guys, okay, no, I'll show you tomorrow, or like the next part. So, thank you all for watching, you know, this was a short part, but I will upload them back to back, and yeah, I will see you guys, and, oh, never mind, if, comment where you want her to go, I have all the expansion packs so I have all the world so if you want me to marry someone in like some Sunset Valley something like that let me know okay so I will see you guys next part don't forget to comment and subscribe it really makes me happy and yeah bye everyone